Hey guys, it's the Soul Cloth here, and today in this monster analysis video, we're going to be going over Glowbird. I'm going to be telling you guys whether or not he's worth getting out of his new challenge. So let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so Glowbird is a tank, and his traits are going to be Control Immunity, Super Attuned, and Taunt, which are actually pretty good traits. His rank 0 and rank 3 are definitely very good. His rank 1 is kind of really bad. But yeah, rank 0 and rank 3 are both pretty great. And then his relics are armor and essence, which are also pretty amazing. Those are really good relics for a tank. Now let's go on down to the pros and the cons. So he has solid elements in the current meta. He's got great life, a decent trait, fire and thunder immunities are useful due to his elements. He also has access to maximum life increase, which is very cool for a tank. He also has amazing relics and decent cooldowns and stamina costs. And then his cons are taunt is just an effect, so it is very easy to remove. And his only skill that reapplies taunt has a 3 cooldown, which is kind of annoying. And then he has awful speed and only heals for self-sustain, making him vulnerable to reverse healing. So yeah, some of those cons are kind of big. Awful speed doesn't really matter that much. But yeah, the rest of his cons are kind of bad. So now let's go on to the moveset. So he has a self-thunder immunity, which is honestly kind of a really bad move. He also has a self-three turn taunt with a 20% maximum life increase and team stamina regeneration. He also has an AoE at 30 nature damage with quicksands, or you can pick a self 20% heal with zero stamina, zero cooldown, which is pretty cool. And then he has a self-fire immunity with 40 percent heal and a team 25 percent heal which is pretty decent so yeah overall this monster is a tank he's a pretty decent tank he's not like super op or anything but if you get him to rank three he is a pretty all right tank to have so yeah if you don't have any tank at all you could definitely go for him try to rank him up but yeah if you already have like any other tanks then it would probably be better just to use them but yeah glover's a pretty decent tank if you have him you can go and use him if you don't already have a tank or you can go ahead and get him out of the event if you need a tank. Yeah, that is going to be for this video. Let me know down in the comments what you guys think of Glowbird. And if you guys are going to be getting him or using him. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Remember to like, share, and subscribe. Goodbye.